Hey guys, John with Off Grid Homesteading. This is the day. Uh, we got everything sort of going. Everything lined out. Tractor and auger are ready to start digging our holes for the uh, foundation. So I'm going to get started here in just a minute. Kind of lining everything up. Doing a little test hole, see how that works. We'll go from there. So how far will the auger be able to go down in all this rock? Tis the question. center and you got yourself foot we got about 18 inches right there so you want to stop at 18 it's fine 18 to 2 is fine what we're doing here what else What are you doing now? We're going to pull the uh, piece of rebar out and then we're going to actually drill right about here so that we can make sure that the uh, pole is centered. This is the edge, outside edge. That way we get concrete on the outside too. That here, center point. Come in right there, see. Help me get a line, tractor. Up there, I think. That's too far, I think. That's too far. Oh, no, it isn't because here's the hole. You need to come right here. So will this hole be the same as the other Ozark hole? I hope so. I hope they all go the same way. With ease and joy, baby and some magic sprinkled in. Okay, so we got, I got all the holes done except for uh, two at the back end. And that's all I can get done today. Uh, we're gonna have to do more of this Finish this up tomorrow, get the poles in, and uh, start putting the boards on and getting rolling. So, we've got uh, one more, not this hole, we got, that hole's done. So one more here, and one more there, and that one is real close to where the water line could be. So I gotta do that probably manually. And uh, outside of that, that is the beginning of the new building so thanks again for watching us in off grid homesteading um maybe we can catch up with you on the next time take care